The Photoshop CS6 beta is full of new features. One of the most exciting is the changes to our content-aware family of technologies. We have changes to content-aware fill itself, an enhancement to the patch tool, which introduces content-aware technology, and the brand new content-aware move tool. Let's take a look at how they work. For this first image, let's look at content-aware fill, which is faster and more powerful than ever before. Content-aware fill is great for moving a section of an image like this. Uh, it could be a spot on the lens, water. In this case, it's this reflector, and it does a great job. However, on an image like this, if I use content-aware fill, I'll often bump into a problem. I haven't given it enough of the image to look at, and I've pulled in some artifacts. What people have asked for is a change to the patch tool to enable it with content-aware fill, and that's just what we've done. And what I can do is pull that selection over and source from the right-hand side of the image and fill that in using content-aware fill. Think of this as user-driven content or fill. OK, so back to our original image. There's an entirely new tool. And I'm going to load a selection. And what we want to do is move this woman on the right-hand side over to the left-hand side. Now, traditionally, this would involve a lot of masking, selections, and advanced compositing. But with this brand new tool, all that I need to do is make a loose selection, pull her over to where I want to put her, and it's going to look at the neighboring pixels. It's going to remove her from one side, drop her into the other side, and quick and easy. There I go. There is one other thing I can do with this that I could never do before. And I'm going to make a selection of the roof here. And then change my mode to extend. And I can grow that really quickly and easily. So there you see just some of the changes we've done to the content-aware family of technologies. All new content-aware fill algorithm, changes to patch to enable it with content-aware fill, and the brand new content-aware move tool.